Patriot Prime Reviews is a channel for adult collectors and may not be suitable for children under 13 years of age. Viewer discretion is advised. Hey, what's going on guys? Patriot Prime here once again with another ToyHacks.com sponsored review. But before I get started, I need you guys to do me a favor. If you're watching this video right here and are not a subscriber of Patriot Prime Reviews, please consider hitting that subscribe button right now. It won't cost you a thing, but will help me and my channel out tremendously. Now, on to the decals. And the set we're looking at in this video is for the War for Cybertron Trilogy Netflix Nemesis Prime trailer. Now, this set was sold separately, and the reason being, Boy Hacks gave owners of this set three different options to utilize this black trailer. One was a Nemesis Prime decal set, two was a Generation 2 decal set, and three was a Shattered Glass Optimus Prime decal set. Now, the reason I went with Nemesis is I have this sweet upgrade set for him, including the Nemesis Drone and Nemesis Roller. And if you want to see my review of this upgrade set, just click that link above. This decal set includes two decal sheets, both on foil backing. So now, let's take a look at the Nemesis Prime trailer, both before and after Toy Hacks decals. And welcome to Patriot Prime Reviews. <laughs> Now, straight out of the packaging, Nemesis Prime's trailer doesn't look too bad. It's got lots of nice molded detail all the way around and this awesome chrome and turquoise stripe that extend the length of the trailer with the purple Decepticon logo right there. Got silver rims for the wheels, lots of detail here on the back, and that's pretty much it for the outside of the trailer. Now, once we open it up, Lots and lots of molded details, but look how plain that is. It's just completely black. And then, of course, you've got the drone right here that's, once again, completely in black, except for the little arms right here, which are kind of a dark gray. So there you go. That is Nemesis Prime's trailer before and after. Nemesis Prime's trailer gets a brand new long decal that goes all the way over the entire length of the trailer, and this one now is black and turquoise opposed to the chrome and turquoise, and it also gets a much larger Decepticon logo, and of course you get one of those on each side. Now the rear of the trailer, you get decals here up top, a stay clear, and three circle decals, a decal right there in the center, and taillights. He also gets a Nemesis Prime license plate, and you get quite a few options for license plates, and they give you plenty and even doubles. We've got Black Convoy, Scourge, Scourge, Mech One, Nemesis. So I went with Nemesis because I put Nemesis on his robot mode. Now, the sticker map says to put the license plate right here but when you bring the door down it pushes that license off every time so i put it right there and i think that looks pretty good and that's pretty much it for the outside of nemesis prime's trailer now let's get him opened up so you can see the inside and what a difference toy hacks makes you've got the new blue diamond plating all along the center of the trailer you've got the go decal that's very reminiscent of g1 you got these red decals along the inside and along the sides are monitor screens with all kinds of different information on them you got a galaxy map there different readouts it's this is cool i love it it's very similar to the earthrise optimus prime decal set and good old repair drone here get some decals as well that really makes him look a lot better i love the red cell shaded windows there 
along the canopy, and there's red decals here on the side. There's also kind of a chrome decal here on top and right around those little ports. So man, I love the looks of this now. What a difference. Let's get those out. And there you go, guys. There is Nemesis Prime's trailer after. Toy Hex once again comes to the rescue by enhancing a very bland trailer. This trailer now has so much more playability than it did before. I love the added details such as the diamond plating and all of the monitors and sensors and really, really love this red on black canopy and stickers for the repair drone. This really makes the trailer pop and I can see me using it a lot more with my displays. Not to mention, I do love the wider and brighter stripe for the outside of the vehicle. Now, keep in mind the Nemesis Prime robot set that has decals for Nemesis Prime and Fangtron is sold separately. And if you want to check out my review of that set, just click the link above. Now, if you enjoyed the video, don't forget to like, don't forget to subscribe, and don't forget to click that bell icon to get notified when I upload new reviews. And big shout out to those of you subscribed to the channel. We're getting closer and closer to my 10,000 by TFCon goal. Once again, guys, this is Patriot Prime signing out. Hooah!